a resume a mile long. Two-time Hall of Famer, one of WWE's most dominant champions. He is immortal. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Venice Beach, California. Weighing in at 303 pounds, the immortal Hulk Hogan! Hero to generations, a beacon of hope to young Hulkamaniacs like uh, one Brian Kelly. Oh, I know that guy. Hulk Hogan created an entire paradigm shift, transcends sports entertainment, and Hulkamania continues to run wild here tonight. The WWE Universe still on its feet. It's because they know this is going to be special. And they want to see what those 24-inch pythons can do. Oh, Byron, we already know those pythons can topple giants and defeat any mortal man. This one could be a match for the ages. Yeah, now we're talking. And his opponent from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 286 pounds. He is the World Heavyweight Champion, the Beast, Brock Lee's. It's WWE. You know you always have to be ready for anything. And the referee for this match is motioning to the superstars, saying they need to get into the ring. Yeah, trying to steer this chaos where it belongs. Jeez. Oh, my gosh, what impact. This is a pretty dangerous place to fight. Screens, exposed metal, ledges. So much could go wrong very quickly. And a little disrespect for dessert. Just how desperate do you have to be? Why not a fair fight, huh? And I think we all know nothing good comes of fighting on the stage. Case in point, nothing good happening right now. Vertical suplex. Nice. He's lost some of his win now. Yeah, Hulkster showing the immense power of the Pythons. When it comes to Lesnar, we already know what strategy he has in mind. Eat, sleep, conquer, repeat. Yeah, there's a reason Lesnar has made a victim out of every superstar he's ever been in the ring with. And unfortunately for Hogan, tonight will most likely be no different. Backbreaker! This arena can't contain them, and if history's any indication, nothing good's about to happen up there either. And he saw that coming from Brock. Hulk Hogan playing to the crowd now. He's trying to intimidate his opponent one more time, but he's got to strike soon. Get his press! Brock's face has seen better days, I can tell you that. There are a lot of ways this can go sideways. Everything on that stage looks like it hurts. Hogan winning that exchange. Series of reversals. Cuts off their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. Well, that'll about do it. The official has waved this match off. I can't believe they threw out their chance to settle the score just to have a fight on the outside. Well, sometimes it's not about wins and losses, Saxton. Sometimes it's just about sending a message.
has made it back to the ring, and we can officially start this match. Oh, man. Yeah, the refs got their hands full in this one. Suplex brings them down. Vicious right forearm. This is just brute power. Release German. Able to reverse. Look at this straight big power slam. Elbow drops to the solar plexus. And a little disrespect for dessert. There was no issue with that attack. Hey, sometimes desperate times call for desperate measures. Who are we to judge? Oh, look out. All oh, the weight crashing down. That was more splatter than splash. There's two. Barely kicks out. Very close. Fatigue clearly set again. Hulk Hogan has made a career out of overcoming adversity, but Brock Lesnar is understandably a whole other type of adversity. Corey, what do you think Hogan needs to do here if he wants to come out on top against the Beast Incarnate? The thing about Hogan, Cole, is he always has one thing his opponents are severely lacking. The energy of all the Hulkamaniacs propelling him forward. So once again, he needs to channel that energy. I assume he already said his prayers. Cover! And shoulders up before a count of one. It is going to take a lot more to keep him down. Get his press! That was a vicious display. You can almost see the disdain in their eyes. A surprising lack of brutality from Lesnar there. Close line! What impact! Got their opponent up. Snake eyes! Ah, uh, heel hook. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch, too. Escape just in time. Face Buster plants him. And the knee. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Brock here now, not used to being without the momentum. That's because Hogan is fired up, targeting Lesnar big time. A scrape to the face to finish it off. I see how it is. Going to take any shortcut to bypass a clean competition. Hey, there's nothing wrong with a shortcut, Saxton. Crank in the head. Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. Get his press! And any one of those shots could take you out for good. Well, timely counter by Lesnar. He's able to combat out of Brock's grip. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. Hogan here asserting dominance. Hulkster showing that colossal power he possesses. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. He's one step ahead there. Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming next. Oh, what a counter. Now Lesnar looking for some momentum. Good chance for him to regain his wits. Close line! Uh-oh. Lesnar quick to counter. Ooh. And this one might be headed ringside. And gets tossed back into the mat. Sequence of reversals here. Both superstars clearly studied game tape ahead of time. The Hulkster continues to survive. Yikes, that'll either wake you up or knock you out. Ah, scrape to the face to finish it off. All's fair in love and war, gentlemen. I saw nothing but effective offense. Just cranking the head.
stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. Oh, an incredible seated suplex. Pot right in the stomach creates the separation. Working on their arm and countered with a knuckle sandwich. Oof, a shot like that would counter any attack. Lesnar caught by surprise. Hogan with the boot. He thinks he has it. Three, no. I am in shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Uh-oh, the beginning of the end. Incoming. Leg drop. That spells trouble for Lesnar. the kick out what strength the scary thing is this is ordinary for the beast incarnate it's going to take a lot more to keep lesnar down for the count and now flying a big height bigger impact that's gotta be it two no he gets the shoulder up this is no time to hesitate you can feel the end coming and up the turnbuckles we go the Hulkamaniacs are going wild now. Take off. Oh! Takes another trip to the skies, and it pays off once again. And the momentum's clearly against Brock now. We hardly ever see Lesnar in this alarmed state. Get yeah. his press! And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. Brock managing to get some control back now. Lesnar with the F5. That's it. Brock's got this. A kick out. Oh, my God. You got to be kidding me. What just happened? I don't know, but I think it just blew the roof off this arena. And you have to think Lesnar is only going to double down on his intensity after coming so close there. I don't think anybody can stop the Beast Incarnate. it right back look at this going counter for a bear hug squeezing the the bear hug cinched in gotta find a way out and catch your breath look at this no quit whatsoever raining down elbows and escaping the bear hug get this press Hogan feeding off the crowd feeding off their energy He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. Whitney Lariat. This could do it! Hulk Hogan gets the win. No doubt it was a good one. Here's another look. We just witnessed one for the ages. Hulk Hogan standing tall over the beast, Brock Lesnar. It was no easy task for Hogan, but to be fair, the Hulksters overcome the odds time and time again. Just add this one to the history books.
And he gets set back into the ring. Hogan's feeding off the Hulkamaniacs, directing that in. The Hulkster with a body slam. We know what comes next. Big leg drop, bro. 